Philip Perry. I live in Livermore, California. I found Green Bay site on HomeAdvisor when I began my search for a contractor to come out and do a home repair that uh, we discovered we had a water leak around a sliding glass door at the time we were having a new kitchen floor installed. It, the leak caused a problem that needed to be remediated before the floor could, could be completed and Home Advisor and Yelp is where I started and Green Bay was consistently coming up with good reviews so I put out the call to three contracting firms. Green Bay was the first to respond almost immediately and after asking me a few questions they had me scheduled for an evening appointment for someone to come out to talk to us because I wanted my wife to be present and actually Green Bay um, actually wanted my wife to be present so we would both hear the facts and be able to explain what we were expecting out of the project for a successful completion. And that happened, I believe, within a day of me sending in my uh, request on their website. So that fast response made an immediate good impression. Once we had decided on, on the scope of the project, during my first meeting with Danny Lebowski, who became the project manager, we came up with a list of all of the items that needed to be accomplished. The simple, well, it wouldn't have been as simple as it was in my head at the time, replacement of the sliding glass door with another slider, but rather remake uh, the look of the space by putting, erecting a, a, a regular wall with a window and a pet door that would give us the same functionality we had from the sliding glass door, which it was seldom open. Once we had reached that conclusion, and my wife concurred, Danny began going through the steps that we would need to do in order to complete the project. And I asked Danny a number of questions, particularly surrounding how the work was going to be accomplished. Could I, could I make the clear assumption but once the project began, it would be on a continuous basis. I wouldn't see crews for a couple of hours a day. I wouldn't see different crews on different days. I would see a team that was assigned to my project in order to make sure there was continuity of knowledge of what was happening and that we would proceed at a pace that I would consider acceptable. Due to the fact that I'm re re now retired, I was I played the role, sort of the role of what I called on-site supervisor. So I would I was actually observing the crews as they were working uh, from the day of demo through the final sign-off on the permit, and we had reached an agreement to do as little damage to the existing blank floor in the kitchen but we knew we had to investigate the water damage that was obvious uh, and that Danny saw at our first meeting and said, I can't tell how hard this goes, we're gonna have to see. Luckily, it, only, it didn't go as far as I feared and the crew came out, removed material, removed the wall. We were quickly able to see the extent of the water damage and they came up with a, a plan to remediate that by rebuilding the sill plate and replacing some of the joists under the floor so that it would be ready for my flooring contractor to come back and weave planks back into the floor. As part of uh, creating the wall with the window, uh, we also agreed that the outside of the wall would be stuccoed to match the existing texture of the house. We came up with the idea that since my wife was planning to have the house painted this year, we would use that wall to experiment with our chosen color for the house. So Danny brought us but every color in the universe to look at and we, we chose one 
and we had that wall painted that color. We decided we liked it. And that became the color that we used for the project to paint the entire house. The project itself was a, a, a very pleasant experience, particularly compared to other projects we've had, had done around the house. The crew would always arrive during the time frame I was told they were, would arrive. They came prepared. They knew what they were going to accomplish on that day. They worked in a skillful manner and were constantly um, cleaning up after themselves as they went from task to task to make sure that when they would leave at the end of the day, my the interior of the house was, remained livable, as dust-free as possible in a construction area. They erected a plastic wall to contain the uh, debris within about a six-foot area around the project. They also cleaned outside every day, picking up scraps of materials, sweeping, um, sometimes washing them with water if it was necessary, depending upon what was done. They were conscious of the plants around the house, uh, around the exterior, as we moved on to the, ex the additional parts of the job. So I would have to say it's been my, definitely my most pleasant engagement with a contractor. Our project manager, Danny Lebowski, I met on the day that I thought I was just going to come out, sit down with somebody who was going to come out very quickly, as I have from my past experience, look at the job and give me an estimate. That was not Danny's approach at all. Danny and I worked our way into daily visits, daily conversations, Sometimes I would call him before he called me if I was excited about something that happened. And he would say, I know, I know, they already told me I was going to call you. And it, was, it became sort of funny. And, you know, Danny and I were, were in a business relationship. But over the course of the project, we developed a friendship um, that I think will carry on for some time. He became the face of Green Bay for me. And he would always listen to what I had to say. He would take my, my questions or requests back to the office and talk to the owners about things that I would like to see done. And I think he represented me well. Um, they've proven themselves to me in a way that shows me the difference between working with an established, licensed contractor who believes in the permitting process, believes in the building code, and hires what appear to be the best talent available in the Bay Area.